Recently I tried to melt down a weed eater engine and I ended up burning one of the pieces because it was made out of magnesium instead of aluminum. If I want to avoid that in the future, I can do extra testing besides the magnet test, which is good for separating steel and iron from other metals, but it doesn't help separate magnesium from aluminum. I'll use common household vinegar to test magnesium and aluminum. First I'm going to test the uh, aluminum ingot. Not seeing any bubbles. I'm going to test the magnesium. You can see some bubbles forming there. You can actually hear it bubbling. For a bigger reaction, I'm going to file the magnesium. Now I'll do the same thing with the aluminum. Another way to test is by burning the magnesium. For this part, I'm going to have some sand on hand uh, just in case. Now for comparison, I'm going to try that with aluminum. Thanks for watching.